Hi there, my name is Lyle and I am a final year medical student at Newcastle University and last year I integrated in a Masters by Research in Cardiovascular Health and Sciences and today I'll be discussing what is an integration and why would you do it. So an integration year is a year away from your medical degree dedicated to studying a specific area of interest or gain another degree. Yes, it is going to be weird because you kind of graduate, your first graduation will be your intercalation year and then you'll have a second graduation which will be your graduation from your medical degree. And depending on which type of intercalation your degree you'll be doing, you could actually graduate from a master's before you graduate from a bachelor's degree. Many medical schools in the UK have now adopted an intercalation year. Some universities make it compulsory, so you do a six year course. Some universities give you an opt out system in which it's part of your normal six years medical degree, but you can choose to not do the intercalated year if you have a specific reason not to do it. And lastly, you can also have some medical schools which it is not compulsory and it's optional. And that's what Newcastle University gave me an option to do. I chose to be able to go out of my way to want to study a specific subject outside of a medical degree. So depending which university you do it in, you tend to do your intercalation year after either second, third or fourth year of studying a medical degree. It de also depends on which type of degree you want to do, whether it's a master's or whether you want to do a bachelor's. So there is a wide range of subjects that you can choose from when you're deciding to do an intercalated degree. And these can also determine on what type of degree you do as well, whether it's a bachelor's or a master's. If you do a bachelor's of science, a bachelor's of art. If you do a master's, which is a taught master's, do you have some taught modules or whether you do a master's by research as well. And there's loads, massive spectrum of courses you can do, such as from surgical anatomy to medical law, to doing a master's of research in a specific area of interest, or if you want to do clinical genetics, for instance, there's so many opportunities to study at such an interesting range of courses, whether it's internally in the same institute as your medical school, or whether it's externally in another university in the country. So as part of my intercalated year, I did an intercalated master's by research in cardiovascular and health and sciences in Newcastle University. This was a research master's, but it also had some taught components towards it as well. So I did three taught modules before Christmas um, in semester one, which was in developmental genetics, global health and cardiovascular health and sciences. I then did a six months research project with the congenital heart disease group at the Centre for Life, which was a very, very fun and interesting experience to be involved with in learning loads of important laboratory research skills as well. And it was a great year to be involved in some really nice and interesting research in that institute as well as it also being sponsored by the British Heart Foundation. So the reasons why I decided to do an integration year was that I knew that once I started working I didn't want to leave a working career to then go back to education, I kind of wanted to complete all my education together. I also understood that I wanted to have a break from medicine, I absolutely love studying medicine, but I wanted to explore an interest beyond my medical degree and something from that I've been always interested in since the preclinical years. And it also gave me great opportunity to learn new skills and work within a laboratory something that you don't really get a chance to do in medical school so i absolutely love that component of it as well so what are the benefits of studying an integrated degree it give it gives you lots of variety to explore topics beyond your medical degree it gives you a change of scenery for a year and an opportunity to take away take a break away from medicine it gives you an opportunity to study at a different university that has different teaching methods it gives you opportunity to explore your interests beyond a medical degree or something completely separate from medicine as well. It can give you an opportunity to do some research experiences if you're really interested in research. It also gives you something, an opportunity to be able to do something different beyond medicine and broaden your horizons. And it also can be used in your future later career pathways when you're trying to apply for speciality training as well.